Hey guys, this is Versatile from VST Power, now host on Project Phoenix Media. Today's video game tutorial, I'm going to show you how simple it is to play Naruto, Shippuden, Ultimate Ninja Storm, Revolution, emulate Xbox 360 game controller using the X360 CE program, and you can use this for a PC, USB game controller, or in my case, a Sony PlayStation 2 game controller with a twin USB joystick adapter. So how does this work? If you go to the more info section, I got a link to code.google.com slash p slash x360 ce go to the show all button under downloads and download the 212 191.zip file or whatever is the latest version of this program once you have that zip file go ahead and extract that into your main Naruto game folder so I already done that already so let's go ahead and run the x360 ce program it's gonna ask you to create an INI file as well as a DLL file so let's go ahead and say yes to both of those prompts. If you're curious about the type of PS2 game adapter I'm using, take a look in the bottom left-hand corner of this video. So right now what I'm doing is I'm getting settings for controller port 1 as well as controller port 2. We see that this thing just crashed. I'm not really sure why it did. So let's go ahead and rerun the program one more time. It should not crash like that. But sometimes things happen. Let's do it one more time. Okay, sweet. So controller 1, let's do this. A, B, X, Y. Triggers, select, start, but the D-pad is not working. Not to worry. Go to D-pad, D-pads, D-pad one. Now it's good to go. Awesome. Click on save. You're good to go. Go ahead, run your launcher here. Um, start your game. It will automatically recognize your game controller, and you're ready to have a lot of good times here. So with that said, let's jump into the gameplay footage tutorial. Let's do this. All right, here we are at the main menu of Ultimate Ninja Storm Revolution. So let's do this. Let's press start on my PS2 type game controller. Here it is. Check it out in the camera, guys. And what I'm going to do is I'm not just going to I'm not going to do an online battle today. I'm sort of sick of that right now. So what I'm going to do instead is I'm just going to do a quick free battle old school style. And once we get to the main menu, I'll show you how that works. Awesome. So we can clearly see that my Xbox 360 game controller buttons are working so I'm gonna, let's go ahead and go down to free battle press A to confirm or X on my PS2 game controller and once I'm inside the game let it load here and then we'll have a lot of good times today alright sweet we're in the game let's do a uh, I don't know survival is okay let's just proof of concept show you proof that yeah this does work with my uh, game controller here so that's fine. Yeah, okay, whatever. Single match, that's fine. Let's go ahead, let's pick a character here. I'm gonna just do a random select right now. That's fine. Not a random select. And let's do this. Now, I am not a very good player. I'm sort of new to this game as well, so I may get my butt kicked. I get my butt kicked online all the time, actually. But I am learning, and it's a fun game, especially you do versus mode. Yes, you can do split screen. If you got two controllers, you can definitely do that. And then uh, playing online is also a lot of fun as well, too. Both players' ATKs are double. Nice. Let's do this. Let the battle begin. Oh, foul. Fail. Anyways, we can clearly see if the game works out fine with the X360 CE control em emulator with my PS2 game controller. If you guys have any nitpicky questions, leave a comment here on the YouTube page, and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Once again, thank you for watching. Take care. Bye.